away from John Gregory, Graham Roberts, Archibald to his right, he overran it, but still got through. This is Graham Roberts, was he brought down? Penalty! Tony Curry came in behind him. Fennick was in close attendance, but a penalty has been given, and it was a splendid run by Graham Roberts. Terry Venable's side couldn't stop him. Bob Hazel made an error in that early on, but Roberts went on. And what happens here? Tony Curry comes in with the tackle, down he goes, penalty, Hoddle to take. Scores. Never has a penalty been missed in an FA Cup final at Wembley. And Tony Curry gave that one away, the Rangers captain. And it was the Tottenham playmaker, Glenn Hoddle, who wasted no time in converting it. And Tottenham were glad to see Perryman step in. Archibald's away, put there by Hoddle. Can he make sure this time? Archibald! He's at the post. An agonising cup final for him. Archibald with that opportunity to make it 2-0. At last he beat Hucker, but he didn't beat the post. Well, the stadium humming now as the Spurs fans look again anxiously at their watches. They know, as Glenn Hoddle knows, that we're in time being added on by the referee for stoppages. And there it is. Tottenham Hotspur have won the FA Cup two years running. But Hoddle's congratulations of Waddock say it all. Ray Clements is relieved because Queen's Park Rangers put up a wonderful fight in the second half here and Tottenham hung on for dear life and they hung on successfully.